Welcome to Flyer's coverage of Aero 2024. It's brought to you in association with Continental Aerospace Technologies and Cirrus Aircraft. I'm here with Karen Hong, Global CEO of Continental Aerospace Technologies. Karen, it's been a year since we spoke. We were on this very stand in this very hall a year ago. Um, back then you were, you were in full swing with the new premises, which I assume is a big project that's still continuing. So maybe you can give us a bit of an update, give us some highlights over, over the last 12 months. Sure. First of all, so nice to see you again. You too. Um, uh, after last year, we have done a lot. You know, I try to have a high summary. First of all, R&D sized. Uh, after last year, we announced the uh, CD300. CD uh, 300, uh, 300, the TBR extension from 1200 to 2000 hours. We carry the momentum to the 2024. For example, we just uh, yesterday just unveiled the latest evolution for the Jet A product line. This is the CD 170R, which is a particular tailor for the uh, rotorcraft application. And that means we continue committed to serve more pilots and operators. And also good news, very excited, uh, motivated the whole Continental team, which is last night, we won the Flickr Magazine's 2024 Basset Diesel Engine Award. And that was for which engine? The that's a CD300. The CD300, well, yes. congratulations. Thank you. I hope, I hope it was a good night. So, I mean, I, I don't know if you're going to tell me this, but everybody I talk to about the 170R says, which helicopter is it going in? Is, is, is that public knowledge yet? Stay tuned. Maybe before next year. Before next yes. So effectively, this is where the gearbox was, isn't it? Yes, there's no uh, gearbox. Uh, very good question, because without the gearbox, we have the best power and weight ratio which is with uh, 37 pounds less than this, uh, the regular CD-170. And, and also uh, you asked me what happened to the Continental. So besides R&D, we have successfully launched the uh, Blue Marlin project, which is we've been, uh, you know, working on it for the past a few years and we finally 100% launch and 100% of equipments in production. So on top of it, we roll out in 2024 is a world-class manufacturing WCM. Under that umbrella, we're not only talking about the cost efficiency, but also focus on people development and uh, safety, pro, um, safety and quality promotions and also environmental, including the, the machine maintenance and every full scope. So is, is the, how much, how long before the new facility is fully up and running? So actually it's a, it's a fully running it's already. Fully running yes, 100% successful. So that's been a, what, two, two, three year project? Yes, yes. Due to the COVID, we delayed a little bit, yeah. but we uh, pick up the speed now is 100% in production. And, and is, is continent, I mean, there's the, the whole of the aviation industry has been talking about supply chain issues for, for quite a while. But presumably the new the Blue Marlin project and everything else is, is gonna start to have a positive effect on, on supply chain. So we, just like the other companies facing um, very challenging supply chain issue. However, we have a very strong team our supply chain, uh, supply, uh, our supply chain team has been done a beautiful job as building the global supply base and helping our customers, also helping us to uh, keep the lead times very competitive. Excellent, jolly good. And uh, what <clears throat> can you tell me? What you might be telling me next year? What are, what are the secrets? I promise I won't tell anybody. <laughs> uh, this is a very good question. How about that? I want to see you every single year, okay. more than one time. How about next time I tell you? Oh, next time we'll be fine. And maybe if we can, we will come and have a look at your new facility in Mobile. We, we keep 
we keep talking about it. Maybe this time we'll actually get around to making it happen. You are welcome anytime. So just let me know the time. Will do. I will see you over there. I look forward to that. Thank okay. you very much. Thank you.